<laughs> hey, okay, it's really noisy, but I wanted to get this National Gallery here. I'm in London this week at a conference, and the National Gallery has artists and paintings, right? From famous artists and paintings. So if you are a painter and you're not in the National Gallery, okay? Still a good painter? You're going to still keep painting? Or are you going to give it up because you're not in there? You might never be in there. In fact, the chances are really good that you will never be in the National Gallery, at least as an artist, with your work hanging in the wall. So, you're going to give up? <laughs> you're not paint anymore? Even if you just kind of like it? Just kind of, you know, you know, I'm never going to reach those heights. So I'm just going to stop. I'm at a writer's conference here, and two days ago, a guy I really admire, I, I know him, I consider him a friend, and he's Mark, German guy, and he's doing awesome in his nonfiction books. They're very similar books. Some might call that competition. <laughs> Let's call it collaboration. It's friendly author world, seriously. And yet, he's on stage given the presentation about the nonfiction, you know, success, book author stuff, right? Um, and I'm not, and I'm in the audience, and he and I write similar books. I think, I think I've written like as many, if not more books than he has, right? So, should I quit? Am I not a success? Because he, he could say, well, I'm not as much of a success as he is. Yeah. Sure. He's on stage, I'm not. I want to be on stage. Am I envious? Yeah. Do I want to be there? Yeah. Does that mean I should stop? Because he's there and I'm not? No. <laughs> we haven't gone yet. I'm in London. Out of conference. Doing it. Doing the work. Having fun. On my way to go meet some writer friends. We're heading down to Electric Avenue. It's a little higher. I don't know the words. I don't know any of the words. I know Electric Avenue. I shouldn't be a singer. <laughs> That's it for today, really. It's very similar to a chapter in my recent book. Something like, live a little bit of your dreams today, rather than waiting until your dreams come true. So, that's the hard part. We can get to that future. I will arrive at that point that I dream about, where I know I can get to. Just like Mark. Mark's already there. I'm not there yet. So, but I'm going to keep going. So I can get there without getting killed going across the street. What's this? Oh, National Gallery. Okay, so clearly I'm not paying attention to where I'm going because I'm doing kind of U-turns. <laughs> You know what? That's applicable. I'm having fun just walking around London. Probably going the wrong way. But having fun doing it. I'm going to do it anyway. Eventually, I will get to my destination. But here is the point. The killer. The point. The big, the big, here we go. National Gallery in the background. Are you ready for this? I need to be okay with where I am right now. And then... And only then can I take steps towards the future. Can that future path be open? Will that welcome mat be out? It only begins when I accept, acknowledge, and even appreciate. Ooh, three A words. Accept, acknowledge, I guess those are similar. Acknowledge and appreciate where I am right now. It's not, oh, I'll be happy when I get there. Oh, everything will be great when I'm the one on stage. Sure, that'll be nice. But now is nice, too. This is good, too. This is awesome where I am. I appreciate where I am today. Do I appreciate that more in the future? I don't think that's the way it works. I think I appreciate where I am now. And at that point, I will appreciate where I am today because where I am today helped me get 
to where I will be in the future. But I need to appreciate, you hear how hard I'm saying this to myself because I struggle with this my, myself, as we all do. I'm not going to suppress the idea that, yes, of course I would like to be on the stage where Mark was two days ago. Yes. Yes, that's my dream of mine. So I will work to get there. I will keep on the path and I will be okay walking around London aimlessly. <laughs> okay, not that so I see a bridge, I see water heading the right place. I hope you can hear me. I know. Ooh, there's Sherlock Holmes. So you gotta check this out. This is great. I hope you can hear me. I know the audio is really noisy, but part of me, the big part of me, thinks that it's a Sherlock Holmes. It's kind of cool, right? But part of me wants you to experience this city as I do, because I think that kind of stuff is cool and important. <laughs> Everything we want in the future will arrive as soon as we're okay with today. Just as fast as we're okay with where we are today, those steps toward the future will open up. That's it. <laughs> you know? I don't know if you'll feel this, but Doing this here, I'm at six, oh, I'm at six minutes. Six minutes here, and I feel better. I feel stronger just saying this, like a mantra. I am good with where I am today. Saying it to you. I am okay. I appreciate where I am now. And I do. I'm in London. I'm at a writer's conference. I'm with my writer pals. I'm having a great time. And I will also have a great time when I am on that stage. And you know what? Even if I'm not on that stage, I'm going to be having a great time. And that's the important part, to keep that going, to keep enjoying the route. Okay, is this relevant or what? I am on the route. I am not at the destination, yet I am enjoying every step. There you have it. Live from London, I'm Bradley Sharp in a Thursday Thunder Repossible podcast. Great to have you listening and watching. I'm here every single week, no matter from where, doing what, where I am in the path, I am walking the path. And here's my hand. I'll put it out to you. To welcome you. Wow, that's noisy. Put it out for you. Join me up the stairs. I'm going to bring you up the bridge. Heading up. Heading across the bridge. Cross that river of change. And if it's kind of deep and the current's really fast, get on the bridge. I'm almost there. All right, we're possible least us. Here's the London Eye for you. There you have it. In London on a Thursday. It's Thursday, spring and thunder arrives. Lightning hit Tuesday. Guy on stage. Thursday, thunder arrives. I feel it in my heart. I feel it in my power. And I moving forward on the path. You hope you're going to win. See you next week.